at a place called La Blanc Patate. This restaurant has been in operation in one form or another since the 1930s, and all they serve are hot dogs and hamburgers. But people come from all over the province because their hot dogs have a special secret. Come with us. We'll introduce you to Leo LeBlanc himself and see if we can get the secret recipe out of the guy who runs LeBlanc Patat. Come on in. Leo's in here somewhere. They're getting ready for lunch, but uh, here he is. Hi, Leo. How, How are you doing? Fine. It's good to, good to see you. You're getting ready for lunch, huh? Yeah, this is going to be there. It's what you are. Really? When did this whole place get started? Late 30s or early 40s. Yeah. This used to be known as P Vans. Yes. Yes. Yeah. We bought an old Nash 29. A Nash? Yeah. Zip it apart, made a chip wagon out of it. Then he was going through towns here, shoot at towns from four to seven every day, when the weather permitted. Ringing a bell, people will come out, little pots and pans and buy five or 10 cents worth of fries. Ah. That went on for a while, then he sold out to his son, which added a steamer and started selling hot dogs. The hot dogs out of a steamer? Yeah. Steamed Steam hot dogs. dogs. Yeah. It was part in the front of the building here for maybe 15 years, something like that. Really? Eventually, Pivon got out of the chip wagon and into this storefront. Now, Leo was working for Pivon at the shop, had been for years, when in 1974, while duck hunting, Mr. Pivon suddenly up and offered Leo the business. They sealed the deal with a handshake, and Leo LeBlanc has been here ever since. Now, not long ago, Leo turned the shop over to his two daughters, who haven't changed a thing on the menu since the old chip wagon days. It's still burgers and fries and a steamed hot dog on a steamed bun, served with a secret sweet cabbage topping. What makes it so special? Must be the mustard. <laughs> Must be the mustard. See, he's, he's being clever, because you put a, a, a cabbage relish. A cabbage relish? Is that, would that be? Is it, no, it's cabbage. It's cabbage. Shredded cabbage on top of the hot dog. But there's got to be something. Oh, we do have a little something on there, but can you keep a secret? Yeah. So can I. <laughs> <laughs> That's as deep as this is going to go, I think. Oh, yes, it is. Hot diggity dog, ziggity boom, what you do to me? It's so new to me. What you do to me? Hot diggity dog, ziggity boom, what you do to me? When you're holding me tight. Now, I want to show the folks this, too, because this is unique. What do you call this, Leo? Poutine. Poutine. And it is cheese curd? Cheese curd, fries, and sauce. And the sauce is like a, a brown gravy. Well, sort of. Is that a secret, too? Something like a hot chicken sauce. Yes, there is a little in there. You're not going to tell me what's in the sauce, either? Well, that's hard. <laughs> We're <laughs> We're the only ones anywhere. that do have it. Good, simple, tasty fare. And for the money, plenty of it. All served up faster than you can reach for your wallet. And just as good as it was that chilly day long, long ago when old Mr. Pivan came in from the cold. Oh. 